Kira, how nervous were you when you saw that last three-pointer go up for Reddy? Oh, I was really nervous. I, if they would have scored it, we, we would have went into overtime. And she just made another three, so I really thought that she had it. Because, yeah. You guys had a nice start to the, the fourth quarter, build an 11 point lead. Uh, how much credit do you give Reading for the way that they came back? Um, I give them a lot of credit because some teams, they like once they're down, they would just give up, but they kept fighting till the end and got it close, three point game. You have four seniors in your starting lineup. How much do you think that experience helps you? Um, I think it helps a lot. We're not all experienced, like, because we haven't made it to the playoffs, like, far into the playoffs, but I think just like, playing together for so long and like it's just been us for the whole time so I think it does help a lot. After what happened the last two years in, in the postseason how nice is it to to get to the championship game? It's really nice we were just excited to get to the Santander because the last two years we lost first round so it's really exciting especially since I won a county in soccer so I can make it too for basketball. You guys were down 7-1 early was that just nerves, do you think? Uh, I think so, yeah. I know we were all nervous. Like, once I got on the court like and started playing, I was fine. But, like, I think everybody was still really nervous. Like, you could tell. How nice is it to have someone who's 6'2", like, ice is there to block shots? It's really nice. I know I can always count on her to block shots and get the rebounds. Do you go up against her at practice? Yeah, she always blocks me. <laughs> You have to pump fake, right? Yeah. <laughs> How much has Coach Gallo meant to this team in his two years? Um, he's won a lot. He brought in a lot of new like plays, and he just gave us a new opportunity, and I think it's really good for us that we got him. You play in a really tough division. Do you think that benefits your team when you get in the playoffs? Yeah, definitely. Especially like now, it's been all Division One teams in the playoffs, and we've played them all already, so it's nothing new to us. And it's always like good competition between our division. Going back to the preseason, did you think this group had the ability to, to get to the championship? Yeah, I think so. Because we're bringing back four starters plus ISIS. So. And we have height that nobody else has and talent. So I think, yeah, it was definitely a thought. What are some of the things when you're not playing basketball or, or soccer, non-sports related that you like to do just for fun? Not really anything. I don't know. You don't have much free time, do you? No, not really. <laughs> no binge watching? Um, sometimes, yeah. Netflix. Uh, what about movies or TV shows? Um, yeah, I, wa I watch movies and TV shows. Any, but any good ones? Um, not, not any off the top of my head. No? no. <laughs> How about music? Um, no, I only listen to music in the car, really. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So you're pretty much focused on sports? Yeah, that's pretty much just school, sports, and then... What are your favorite classes at Wilson? Um, marketing, because that's what I want to major in in college. Yeah? Yeah. What would you like to do as a job? Um, I'm not sure yet. Yeah? No. I'm you have some time to figure it yeah, out. Yeah, I'll figure it Probably out. Probably focused on basketball right now. Yeah, maybe sports <laughs> management or something. Okay. Yeah. Well, thanks for your time and uh, good luck. Thank you.